It's like the bishop says. It's like degrees. For some, for most people, it's like this. First, they will notice problems with the Novus Ordo Mass, liturgical abuses, and also in the the nature of that Novus Ordo Mass. And so they will start looking out for something else, and they will get to the uh, Latin Mass, uh, be it like in Ecclesia Dei community or the SSBX, and and then they will slowly understand that there's still a problem with um, having some contact, having something to do with an Ovisorda, with heretics. And then only after all this learning that people actually get to this understanding of the problem, both of the vacancy of the Holy See as well as the Unicum Mass. So it's something that most people learn gradually. It's a thought, a theological thought that was developed gradually and even now that it is matured most people who get to it to reach that conclusion they will have to go step by step and for for a long time those steps those degrees were the only way to reach uh, the right conclusions however nowadays uh, via the internet and this online diffusion of sadvacantism we are also starting to see people who go, who come straight from modernism into Sedevacantism or come from other religions and they, they, their first contact with the Catholic faith is already uh, through us Sedevacantists and there are even people who are atheists, who their first conversion is already into us because of this widespread um, publicizing of Sedevacantism, this via the internet but still for most people it's something gradual do you think your excellency and this should, um that if somebody like who said vacantes goes to uh, an sspx mass or a resistance mass being themselves said vacantes do you think that what they're doing is is something that wrong or or not not wise or even more would it be something sinful to do Monsignor Quejas de Laurier ensinaba que a misa una cua es un sacrilegio. So, um, our position, which is in line with uh, St. Gertrude the Great, position, Bishop Dillon's position, also the position of the RCM, <coughs> the position of the IMBC in Italy, and the position of most traditionalist Silvacantist groups, and also the position of Father Chicada, is that we do not recommend at all in any under any circumstances, for anyone who attend the uh, Unicum Mass, someone who's already a Silvacantist for sure, and also Bishop Issa added that Bishop Gerhard Laurier himself said that naming a heretic in the canon of the Mass constitutes the sin of sacrilege. Hmm. 